thought I would do a quick video for those who aren't familiar with cloth diapers and especially an all-in-two or pocket diaper system. So this is a one size diaper and it's actually a pocket all-in-two hybrid. You can see the snap there for the snap and insert. There's a couple different ways you can use this diaper. First I wanted to go over how you change the sizing of this diaper. So one size diaper and you change the size with these rye snaps here. There's one, two, three sockets and one stud for each row. So what you do is snap it in the lowest or bottom row of snaps and that changes the rise size. It makes it smaller so this will fit um, newborn and smaller babies probably up to about uh, 12 to 15 pounds and as they grow you can just unsnap the rise and snap it to the next rise and the second rise probably goes to about 20 to 22 pounds. My son is 20 pounds right now and we're still in the uh, second row of snaps here for him. Um, this third set may go to, I don't know, 28 pounds and uh, if you leave it completely unsnapped that's more a toddler size for larger babies. So uh, what you're going to do is you're going to figure out which size you want. And the thing about the rye snaps is you only set it once. You don't need to keep on snapping them every time you wash the diaper. Uh, you just adjust it as your baby grows. So, you know, if you put it on your baby and you find that it's way above the belly button, uh, go ahead and make it smaller. Or if you find they have, I don't know, plumber's crack, go ahead and make the rye setting bigger. So um, we've adjusted the rise. So here's the insert. Again, this particular diaper is an all-in-two pocket combo, so you have a couple different options. You can stuff it, or you can snap the insert in to this, the socket here and, and leave the insert over and use this as a cover. Um, so what you do is now we've, we've put the diaper on the second row of snaps, and what I'm going to do is the insert has um, these different folds sewn in. So this is sort of the small setting, the medium setting, and large and extra large setting. So what you're going to do is if you have the shell on these smaller snaps, you're going to fold it at this first line. Here's the top of the insert. You're going to fold it at this first line. And that's what you would use uh, size-wise. So again, we have it snapped on the second row. So I'm going to go ahead and use this uh, sort of small, medium, or medium fold. I'm going to fold it, and now again, I have a couple different options. I can either stuff it in the, the pocket that's at the top. Okay, so it's all stuffed in there, ready to go. And all you need to do is put it on baby. So you put it on baby, just like a disposable, and here's where you adjust the waist. So depending on if they have a small waist or a larger waist, um, you'll see there's three snaps. One, two, three. I like to snap the first, the, the one on the inside first as I go. And then I snap the other two. And then you're going to tug it around and then adjust the size accordingly to your baby. So you take it off. Now the thing with pocket diapers is when they've soiled the diaper, you can't reuse any part of the system. And what you have to do is you have to take the insert out separately from the shell and put it in your diaper bag or a wet pail or however you're storing your dirty diapers. So again, this needs to come out before you wash your diaper. So now, if you want to use it as an all-in-two, you see there's a snap here at the back and there's a snap on the insert. So you just snap the two together and now you're basically laying the insert on top of the shell and again, you're going to fold it to whatever size you need and then you go ahead and put it on baby. Um, usually I like to you know, put the baby in the diaper and this kind of folds up around the baby first. I pull this up through the legs and then I kind of pull the shell up and around. And again, adjusting the waist as you need it. Now the thing with all in two diapers is you can take the insert out when it's soiled and if they just had a pee, for example, you can discard the insert 
and you can reuse the shell with the separate insert uh, and you again it just snaps in here and you might want to leave the cover out to dry between changes uh, and again then you can just reuse the shell uh, if there's any any questions please feel free to contact me or leave a comment I am more than happy to help